Hello Internet. I just about pulled my hair out trying to do the uh, channel art from my uh, channel here. So I'm going to do this video so that you won't pull your hair out. Apparently, if you try and do this through Firefox, um, well, Google Plus has been making it incredibly hard for you to use any other browser other than Google Chrome or Chromium if you're using Linux in order to access their services. So I can't do this through Firefox anymore. I have to use Chromium. But anyway, you want to go in through this icon, go to Edit Channel Art, and you want to go to the How to Create web page and grab the template. If you don't have the template, it's going to be almost impossible for you to do your channel art. And here's why. On this page, it gives you some image size guidelines of 2516, 1440. But that isn't the size of the image that's on your channel. 2516, 1440 would be from this corner here to this corner here, but what gets shown on your channel is this tiny little bit here to this tiny little bit here. So if you try and make your image to fit this, it's not going to work. If you try and use the minimum size recommended of 1546 and 423, that isn't going to work either. So where it says channel art template, grab that file, that'll download, and the file that you want in that is the one that says channel art template fireworks. Open that up with your paint program. GIMP is a good free program if you don't have one. And this is what you're going to get. Now here's the really bloody annoying part. What they're showing you isn't what you're actually going to get. Your channel art can be from this line to about this line. So let me show you the one that I've got. So I've colored it all black. And I notice my little electric bike here is right under where it says tablet <clears throat> 1855, which would be about here. But as you can see, I'm actually getting a little bit beyond the bike and a little bit to the right here, but not up above and down below. So even this as a marker isn't right, you're actually going to get about here. And same thing about here. So even their template isn't the greatest, because again, that's actually going to be about here and about here. So when you're doing this, put the right hand side edge of your graphic right about this area. Because you're still going to get a little bit of a bar, a little bit of a bar. So by placing it there, you're placing it right about here, which is a good spot to do it. So use their template it's the only sane way of making their graphic image. If you just simply try and do a small little graphic from here to here and then upload it, you're not going to get from there to there. Google Plus is then going to give you a little box from about here to here. You have to have this enormous amount of wasted space above and below your image and to the left and to the right of the image for your image to be sized properly and cropped properly. If you don't do that, it's not going to work. 
Now the other thing is getting rid of your previous channel art. There's no way to do it from YouTube. You've actually got to go to Google+. And you need to do it from your photos. And then you've got a photo tab here on the left. <clears throat> and that'll bring up the list of photos you have. And then you have to click on the photo and then click on the little trash can. But wait, it's still not gone. They're going to try and make it work just like Windows where you then have to come down here and go into your actual trash and click the button in here that will say empty trash. So let me demonstrate that for you. Let me grab another image here. Okay, so I've got an image up. Just revert my image. Now we go back to uh, Google Plus. refresh the page. Now we have the offending piece of art that we want to delete. Again, into the actual trash. Supposedly it will delete after 60 days, but let's take a look at something. All that's now just been deleted, but if I go back in here, and if I go to your photos, I deleted all of these 19 earlier, and these two earlier. So why are they still showing up? Because even when I go back to Google+, Plus, it's only showing me the two. And if I refresh it, it's still only showing me just the two. So why are these other photos still showing up in YouTube? Google Plus has royally messed up YouTube. Let's just hope that after those 60 days, those photos that said have been deleted actually are deleted. We'll have to check back and verify that. Anyway, if you like the video, give it a rating between 1 to 5. One vacuum tube for a staticky picture of Google Plus, five vacuum tubes for a crystal clear Google Plus picture. Have fun, Internet.